This is a green giant <coughs> planted next to Leland cypresses. They were all planted at the same time and the green giant here shows a much denser, fuller conformation than the Leland cypresses. Now these are all planted in a heavy shaded area with a full canopy above them. But they do get about two to three hours in the morning of morning sunlight. But you can see that the green giant is a superior tree to the Leland cypress in the shade. These Lelands have some yellowing on the inner needles and that it was in part caused by stress that they received from last winter. Last winter we had an exceptionally cold winter and many of the Leland cypresses burned over somewhat. These had some burned, they have recovered to some degree, but the green giant had no damage to it whatsoever. These plants have been in here for about two years. They were planted when they were three foot high, and right now they're between five and six foot high. And so you can see, if you're going to plant in a shady location, that the green giant is a better plant than the Leland cypress. We at Highland Hill Farm grow thousands of Leland cypresses and green giants. And we do recommend both of them for shaded locations. Not full shade, but shaded locations. They need a few hours sun a day. But as you can see from this video, the green giant is a superior plant than the Leland cypress.